What is a polyp? Why it is formed? How it is detected? How it is treated without surgery? Polyp is a lump growing towards the lumen of the colon, originating from abnormal growth of inner lining of the colon. Polyps are seen not only in colon but also in intestines and stomach. Polyp formation rates increase with advanced age and within adult age group, polyp formation rates are at 30 to 50 percent. The etiology for polyps to occur are not completely understood, but certain risk factors related with polyps are identified. These can be listed as age over 50, family history of colon cancer or polyp, sedentary lifestyle, high fat intake, high red meat and processed meat intake, low fruit and vegetable consumption, obesity, alcohol, and smoking habits for risk factors of colon polyp and cancers, genetically inherited conditions and inflammatory bowel diseases such as Crohn's disease and ulcerative colitis are associated with colon polyp and cancers. Colon polyps usually present no symptoms. Mostly they are detected incidentally during routine colonoscopy procedures. Sometimes polyps present with certain symptoms depending on the size and the location within colon. Change in bowel movement habits such as urge for defecation, constipation, diarrhea, feces with blood or mucus. Symptoms and signs due to anemia such as fatigue, weakness, exercise intolerance, tachycardia, and palpitation. The gold standard for diagnosing polyps is colonoscopy. Upon diagnosis, endoscopic non-surgical treatments could be performed during colonoscopy procedure. Polyps can be observed in different segments of colon with different size and shapes. They can have shape of mushroom, flat elevation, or depressed from the surface. However, polyps with pedicule or mushroom shaped can be detected readily with standard colonoscopy protocols. Flat and depressed polyps require advanced detection techniques to be diagnosed. While not all polyps having the risk for culling cancer, adenomatous polyps as the most seen type are in high risk for cancer progression. Advanced endoscopic techniques with electronic and dye tools are used to detail surface features of polyps to investigate risk signs. These investigations give detailed information regarding the size and structure. Some polyps observed to be large to block the colon lumen or circumferentially cover a part of the colon. On these situations, polyps are investigated with advanced endoscopic techniques to evaluate whether the polyps extend beyond colon. After all these investigations, which method to be employed for treating the polyp is decided. These methods start from conventional polypectomy and can be followed as endoscopic mucosal resection and endoscopic full thickness resections. Right treatment modality choice is made with right evaluation and right staging to achieve successful treatment results. On our next video, we will be talking about treatment of polyps.